connected cars have evolved so much in the last 10 years. We started with the infotainment system in, in vehicles like Ford and Fiat. And it was all about the connectivity between your phone and your media player in the car. But two or three car generations later, today, we're looking at uh, autopilot and self-driving cars and we're talking about flying cars. There was a car that I saw um, two days ago at the auto show and uh, it's just incredible how much technology has evolved and it's all through the power of software and some of the technology uh, that, that it didn't even exist a few years ago. Uh, going back to your question on, on the importance of 5G, I, I think it's going to unleash a variety of experiences and it will enable self-driving cars to become a reality and cars to talk to each other and, and use it in a safely manner. We're going to see 5G unleash the experiences around virtual reality and robotics. So I'm really thrilled to be here and meet some of the, the folks that are behind developing uh, this technology, but also uh, provide some insight into what this means for automotive. Very important, and I think this also enables uh, newcomers, uh, startups, and new companies to bring uh, new ideas, but also develop new business models. Uh, because we're dealing with totally different new uh, technology, um, and I think the monetization part of it will be totally different than what we had in the past with normal vehicles and services that they were uh, bringing to the consumers. So I, I think um, we'll definitely see um, uh, big companies working closer with startups, uh, looking at mergers and acquisitions in terms of uh, beefing up their portfolio for, for big data, uh, but uh, definitely uh, new business models will surface. Wow, we're still so in the beginning of that, right? I mean, we're looking at um, even evolving the the levels uh, the levels of autonomy, because what what was defined two three years ago needs to be updated to meet the current technology and and the applications that will be developed for the production vehicles. Um, the other thing that I think we'll need to uh, look at is standards and, and revisit the, the, the current standards but also create new ones as we're moving to the new world of mobility. Um, also when it comes to 5G, again, it's been a technology that everybody has been talking about and ex uh, has been very excited about uh, welcoming it to, uh, to the market. 2020, I hear, is still the year. Uh, we're going to have a discussion later today about that. Uh, but again, I think w we'll definitely need to work closer together. So car companies, technology companies, and governments to uh, identify best ways to, uh, to bring these technologies in a safe manner to market.